sex allegations again. Well, the good news is that the Ghana Police Service has promised strict sanctions against 46 of its personnel recalled from UN mission in South Sudan if allegations of sexual exploitations made against them proves to be correct. So this was after an investigation was launched into the complaint that members of the units were having sexual relations with women living at one of its protection camps in South Sudan. Question, are you surprised about the news? And what are your expectations of the investigations? Totally surprised by the action of the security guys, you know. They are supposed to ensure um, or ensure there is peace in, uh, in the country so if they are actually involved in a scandal like this I think they should be investigated and then dealt with uh, properly. Personally I'm not too surprised because this thing has been going on that we hear that people have been sent to um, Arabic countries like Kuwait and others that they've been exploited so me, I'm not too surprised because, and it's natural, people like free things a lot. You being sent there for peacekeeping, are you even a soldier? Even if you're a soldier, who is your commander? Does the army know about all these things? Is the minister for defense aware of all these things? If they are not, then I think it serves them right. I'm not surprised at all. It depends on the punishment they'll give them. If only the punishment is strict, they should. If it only change the rest of them, they should just give it to them, that's all. See, it's just that they are doing their work, but they should do it professionally, that's all. It is unexpected of them. It's a disgrace to Ghana, to, to be frank, and this was not why they were sent there. So, in my perspective, I think they should be dismissed of their duties. They don't deserve to serve the securities in Ghana. Are you, are you surprised? Yeah, very, because I at least expect that from them. So some very well right. suggestions there. Let's yep. check out. Let's, uh, yeah. Let's get on to Facebook. And Kwesi Bwati Anyepa says, I wasn't surprised at all when I heard that the police are taking their own professionalism to the international level. It's a common phenomenon, especially those in the villages. It's either bribe or chasing women. Thumbs up to the military. Walanyo well, says, very worrying that some people are denting the image of Ghana. They must be dealt with for such misconduct. And Nana Kwame says, I expect the results of the investigation to clear the Ghana mission of such allegations, but anything otherwise will be awkward to the nation and the police service. Prince Nuruddin says, very humiliating news. Those cited in the sex allegation report in Sudan must be sanctioned accordingly. And the Champon Kennedy says, we're even lucky they didn't stop commercial vehicles in the third country to take bribe from them. Uh, not that we didn't do that. <laughs> and Nana Kwame Nyame comes in to say, it's very disheartening. Unexpected and gross disgrace to the country and the entire service in general because this has discredited the effectiveness and in se the selection process of personnel for that mission. Besides, the discipline and efficiency of the police service is under disrepute. And Abra Jarvis writes, They are culpable, my brother. Um, throughout investigation was a, done. A thorough investigation, I'm sure. That's okay, what you a wanted. thorough investigation. Uh, needs to be done before or was it done before it just it, it, it came, came out, out. okay Irene your boss says congratulations for showing your waist power is why uh. <laughs> congratulating the police for showing their waist power <laughs> Isaac says let me expect small so I will not be disappointed and Odeshi Bakwami says no never surprised at all charity begins at home Nasser Hassan Yaima writes, won't be surprised if it's true because some of the police, dear. Hmm. And Julius comes to say, should be dealt with accordingly if found culpable. David Ohine comes to say, it's time to name and shame some people in Ghana. These policemen are not different. And <laughs> those are some interesting comments on Facebook.